people. Look, they're beautiful. Wow, we're getting deep. Some deep, some deep stuff. <laughs> My name is Molly Pan and I am a professional portrait photographer from Minnesota, but I live in LA. I've been doing photography professionally for about seven years. Um, I grew up with my dad. My dad had a lot of cameras, so um, I kind of, and he's a, he, he's a pretty good amateur photographer, so I learned stuff from him and I picked up some stuff, some stuff from friends. I've always liked taking pictures of people. Um, I've never really been into landscapes or like city space or anything like that. Um, I just think people are so interesting and um, I've always felt that way. So um, when I got into acting, I was looking for a headshot photographer and I was like, well, I could either spend $500 to get headshots or I can spend $700 and get myself a kit and do it myself. And so like, you know, I'm a super, you know, DIY, do-it-yourself kind of person, so that's what I decided to do, and that was like the beginning of these, this, you know, seven, eight, nine year long journey to where I am now. It's very important to know what it's like on this side of the camera. The different ways that you feel about yourself all comes out at the same time. Um, it's vulnerable, and I think as a photographer, it's just really important to make your clients feel comfortable and feel like they're they're there to have fun and that you know uh, great pictures are going to come out. But the most important thing is to have a good time. Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't answer your question. What was your question? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> as an actor, I spent a lot of time on the front side of the camera and. Um, I, th I think it's it's really important to know your angles and to um, pose correctly, I guess. Um, and so I bring that to the to the back of the, the other side, the back of the camera. I don't know. That's that's what's called. I think it's it's really important to me that people know that they're beautiful and to celebrate that beauty because I think a lot of people go through life hiding and. Um, hiding behind the camera and basically like, oh, I'll, I'm gonna lose 30 pounds and then you know you can take a picture of me. Um, I I find beauty in all types of people, all sizes, all ages, all skin colors, um, and I think that's that's the message. I want to show people that they're beautiful. I have wanted to work with Claudine for so long because she's. She's gorgeous and you know she's got the white hair and she's aging gracefully and um, I, I don't get a chance to work with a lot of older people. The process of aging is just so beautiful and you know now that I'm in my 30s I'm, I'm starting to get go through that uh, that process and I'm really looking forward to getting older. my Canon 5D Mark IV and uh, my favorite lens is my 85mm 1.2. Uh, it's really, it's been my favorite lens ever. Um, I've tried the, the tele zoom lenses and you know I've, I've tried a 50. I just don't like them as much as, as the 85. It's got such beautiful bokeh and just like micro contrast. It's beautiful. I guess the one that really comes up a lot is Back up your files in three different places. Back up your files in as many different places as you can. I've had to do reshoots and I've had to do extra things and spend extra money to recover files. So back up your files to avoid a headache. That's, <laughs> that's the biggest one, I think. They're, they're coming for you. Top one is probably that they're really nervous, um, and uh, so I just tell them to not be nervous because there's really like there's literally nothing to be nervous about. I have photographed so many people, and you know, like I, I feel pretty confident that I'll be able to make people look good. 
Um, and you, like, they can't, I just tell them, like, like literally cannot pick it up. Sorry, I don't know if I can swear, but they can't pick it up. I guess another thing is, like, people don't know what to do. That, my friend, is your job as a photographer. You are supposed to tell them what to do. Um, you, you can't just expect someone to be on the other side of the camera and, like, know where to put their limbs to look good. You're going to be in charge of the situation and you are going to let them know what to do. They're going to totally relax because they trust you. Keep doing it. Do it a lot. Do it every day. Um, and always keep learning. Even if you start out not so good, you're gonna get better. Keep doing it, so just shoot every day. I think it would, I would have to say it's, um, I think, hmm, oh man, that's a tough one. That wasn't on the sheet. <laughs> you're throwing one at me. Um, I, um, oh, nice to meet you, where are you from? Um, even like when someone I'm not photographing and then sometimes I'll be like photoshopping their face in my head. Don't worry, I'm not photoshopping your head. Just kidding. Um, 